This short video will introduce you to Academic Search Complete, a multidisciplinary database primarily used to search for and locate journal articles on almost any topic. To access Academic Search Complete, click on the link Databases A to Z from the library homepage and find it alphabetically in our database list. If you are off campus, you will be prompted to enter your RWU single sign-in. And from the initial search screen, you can see that there are search boxes and many ways to enter, narrow, and limit your search. You can limit to full text, to scholarly peer-reviewed articles, or you can limit to date or publication type. But because we're just starting out right now, let's just run a search and then narrow our search from there. We'll do a search on sea level rise as it relates to cities. Our initial results look very good. However, there may be too many of them and we may want to limit them a little bit. Let's just limit to scholarly or peer-reviewed journals. And we still get quite a few results here, so let's add another keyword, flooding, and run our search again. This first one looks particularly relevant, the impacts of sea level rise on tidal flooding in Boston, Massachusetts. By clicking on it, I get the full record for this article. I find out the author, the journal in which it appeared, appeared in, data, date, volume, issue, and diagrams and images. It's important to come down and read the abstract for the article to see if it's relevant to your research. This will give you a summary of the article in which you can see what it's all about. You will also notice there are some author-supplied keywords that you might want to search in um, subsequent searches. And if you want to get the full text of the article, you can click on the PDF full text right here in the left-hand column. Sometimes this link says check for full text or linked full text, depending on where the online version of the article is located. If the article is not available in any of the library's collections, you can click on the link to fill out an interlibrary loan request. Just fill in the necessary information and the library will get the article for you and notify you by email when it comes in. On the right hand side of the screen you will notice many different tools that you might want to use to print or email the article, to save it, to cite it. This offers you um, many different citation styles which you can copy and paste into your reference list or you could export the citation into a bibliographic manager such as RefWorks or EasyBib. The permalink tool is especially important because you will want to use this particular link to copy into your notes or to um, get back to it at a later time. The link in the browser is, not, is only temporary and will not bring you back to the article. So there you have it. How to find articles using Academic Search Complete. It is a great place to start your research for any topic. And remember, if you need help finding keywords or searching this database, please contact a librarian.